Good morning. This is day 12. Do not be ashamed of the testimony of our Lord. 2 Timothy chapter 1 verse 8. Knock knock. Written by Dave Brannon. A knock came at the door of the home of a man who had a young family. When the father answered the door, he was greeted by someone he had never met. A friendly man from a nearby church who had stopped by to say hello. His pleasant demeanor and kind words impressed the dad and the two agreed to meet again. When they did, the visitor introduced the man to the gospel of Jesus Christ. Both he and his wife trusted Jesus as Savior. That changed everything. The couple began attending church and all six of their children became believers in Christ. Eventually, the dad became a, a Sunday school teacher and a deacon. One of this couple's daughters grew up to attend the same Christian college that I attended. That student's name was Sue. And from the first time I saw this cute girl from Grand Rapids, I was smitten. The man who had answered the door eventually became my father-in-law. That door-to-door -door ambassador changed not just one man, but an entire family. And the results continue to reverberate. Paul encouraged us, let your speech always be with grace, seasoned with salt, that you may know how you ought to answer each one. Colossians chapter 4 verse 6. Whose life, whose future will you impact? Lord, lay some soul upon my heart and love that soul through me. And may I nobly do my part to win that soul for thee. A quote this morning reads, The good news of Christ is too good to keep to yourself. End quote.